Welcome to Accurate Examiner. In this video, we are going to learn about D type uh, function in PySparker. Uh, it is a often a scenario where we need to get the list of the columns and their data types uh, from the data frame. Uh, so this D type function can help us to find the list of the columns as well as their data types. Uh, so here is the definition D type in PySpark data frame function that return a list of tuples. Uh, each tuple contains two elements, uh, the name column and uh, then uh, type of that column. So that's what we will get. So here is my sample data. You have uh, this uh, name Amish Azad, then we have math score, then we have science score, and then we have uh, either the student passed or failed. So true or false values here. And here's the definition uh, for the columns for this uh, data. So we have name, math score, science score, and passed. And here we are creating our data frame called df by using a create data frame function. We have to provide the data and then we have to provide the column names. And here our data frame will be shown by using a df.show function. So let's execute this script and take a look on the output and then we will go from there. So here you can see the output for data frame. We have name, column, then we have math score, science score, passed columns and their, their values. But now I'm interested more to know what is the data type for name column, what is the data type for math score, science score and pass columns. So what I'm going to do is very simple. You will uh, use uh, this function here and uh, now you will execute and it's going to return you the results. Uh, so if you say df.dtypes, uh, that's going to return you the uh, column names and uh, the data types. So. So I'm just executing and uh, you will see right there. So you see right there, uh, it is returning us uh, those uh, tuples uh, and each tuple has two uh, elements. So the very first element is the column name and the, then the data type. So this is how they are separated. You know, you each one uh, have a comma and uh, these uh, these will be each element is looks like this, uh, you know. So this is how they are separated. Each tuple, uh, you know, you can see right there, the second tuple and uh, then uh, third tuple, four tuple, depending upon the number of uh, columns you have. And then inside uh, that, that tuple, each one has uh, the name of the column and the, the data type. If you want to format this in like more readable, that's also doable. You can use for loop. And here I'm using uh, the for each loop and then I'm looping through the df dot df types here and uh, we are printing that out. So let's uh, go ahead and execute this part. It's gonna just print a little bit uh, better. So easy to read, uh, nothing really fancy. So you can see right there, so now we have column and the name of the column is right there. Then we have type and the, the type is string. So the second name of the column is uh, uh, math score and the type is this one. So this is how you will be displaying if you want to display in a very nice way. And uh, uh, I have uh, really used this uh, many times so when I have a, a data frame and I would like to know what exactly is the data type for a specific column. If is it Boolean or it is especially like a double or a, you know decimals and float and all those kind of things. Often you want to see what exactly data type of that column is. I thank you very much for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel and I will see you guys in the next video.